so I just pulled some tarot cards because tarot cards is what I'm using to kind of give me some type of positive energy because that's tarot's kind of all I have right now and it sounds depressing but you know I don't have my family don't have friends my ex-boyfriend doesn't fuck with me so like I'm using myself and I'm using the tools that I have around me and um, today I really started thinking to myself after I journaled I really started thinking or maybe it was just a message from like spirit or something but what do I expect to come from this situation that I'm in right now what good what greatness what change do I expect my mom doesn't want me here she let my brother my older brother move in here he doesn't want me here my job I don't like it there I'll, I'll work a whole entire 10 hour shift and only come home with $80 my mom gave gave me three weeks three weeks to get out what like this this what I'm in right now this situation is just sucking my energy sucking the life out of me and almost making me want to kill myself as bad as it sounds and um I really know deep down inside that I have to leave I have to walk towards the unknown and I have to give life, God, universe, whatever you want to call it. I have to give that my full trust because this every second, every minute that I stay here is the same thing, the same cycle, the same loop over and over again. I'm sorry, there's my lips chapped right here. I'm just trying to fix it because that's really gonna bother me i'm sorry but i just hope you guys get what i'm saying like the reason i'm even posting this is because you know in a few years few years later hopefully i'm more successful and i can look back at this and be like wow wow but um yeah as i was saying like what do i expect to come to me from staying here i'm limited i'm completely limited i'm completely limited and i know it but the only reason i'm here i realize is fear fear is the only reason i'm here because i'm scared of the unknown i'm not trusting i'm not trusting of that there's greatness waiting for me if i leave because i'm scared this is all i know you know i'm 18 years old i, I keep reminding you guys I'm 18 years old, but I still have an old soul, so age doesn't matter, but I'm still young as far as being on earth, so I don't know, all I know is going to school and coming home, and you're supposed to listen to what your parents say, and those days are over. I'm an adult now that has to take care of herself, and believe it or not, that's something I'm really happy to. I've always wanted to just be an adult and take care of myself, even though it's hard. I've always felt like I would be good at it, but... I have to, I really have to leave. I really have to leave. But I don't know. I, I hope you guys can see the like turmoil going on in my head. And also my heart, my heart is saying, girl, you already know you're destined for greatness. You already know all this this and that but you have to do the things that 99 percent of society can't do you have to do those things like you have to do those things you have to basically almost die for what you believe in when you can do that that's how you're, you make your dreams come true but i hate it here there's no type of good coming from here i feel like i'm in the devil's house <laughs> i i was happy more happy in the motel even though it was dirty and gross i was more happy there than i was here and i'm just trying to figure myself out trying to give myself the love that i need trying to try to stop those negative thoughts despite the hell the literal hell that i'm going through but that's another thing to be proud of myself about the fact that my life i don't like <clears throat> 
sorry the fact that i don't like my life right now but yet i'm probably more positive than most of the freaking world another reason greatness is coming for me because my my ability to stay positive and stay trusting i'm obviously not as trusting as i need to be just yet and that's okay because i have been through trauma but i just want to my goal is just to give life my complete trust because nobody knows why or how we were all no one knows why or how we're alive right now no one knows that but yet we are alive and if that's not a reason to trust then I don't know what is but I'm still getting there my ego my mind my inner child you know all that is still suffering healing trying to feel better and I just don't know you guys like I need to leave but I'm scared to leave but I need to leave because no change is going to happen here it's just going to be the same repeated cycle of negativity and mental and emotional abuse I need to leave my job I need to leave all of that I need to do what I need to do and I'm not really posting um, on here for people to give me like what they think I should do because in all honesty um, you can't tell another person what to do with their life until you really figured out yours then when you figured out yours then you can mentor others and help others but TikTok banned my account permanently and I'm kind of glad TikTok's not the app I need to be on I just need to do like little video diaries where I can just vlog and post about what's going on and it's not really, I'm not really doing this for the views. I'm doing this kind of for myself because I genuinely want to be able to look back and see my growth. So yeah, like that's just where my head's at. I might come on here and just talk about what's going on in my mind and what I'm thinking about. And I would love comments of positivity only. Like send me positivity, pray for me, send me love, send me all that. But if you can't send me that, I really don't want your comment. I don't want your subscription. Like, I don't want you to subscribe to me, any of that. I hope you guys don't take that the wrong way. But I just need all the positivity I can get right now. And, um, I just gotta, I hope that video makes sense. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching to the end.